Hello and welcome to Teal House Farm. Today's edition is not going to have very much talking because it is very, very windy outside. But I think I finally put together a plan for the future uh, for our chickens for this coming spring. I just, I don't know. It, I could not get a layout of the farm, like how I wanted it to go, where I wanted animals to be. But I feel like I finally kind of sort of put that together in my head and so we're going to start on that project today. Basically, we're going to move all three kind of chicken coops that we've had in the past. <laughs> put all three together. I'm going to take the wheels, once I get it where I want it, I'm going to take the wheels off of the smaller coop and that's just going to be like a giant egg box. We're going to have chickens lay eggs in there and then I'm going to combine the other two sides so hopefully it'll be big enough to hold 50 or 60 chickens. That's kind of the goal. My big problem is that the two larger coops do not have wheels on them. They're not, they don't really have skids or anything. And so I need to move them on the other side of the house, down where our old shed is just needs to be knocked down. Um, I'm gonna want I want to move them down that way. So I'm gonna have to kind of create my own skids and try and slide them over there. got my trusted, I'm not going to call her my sidekick, more like my leader. My trusted leader is here helping me. We're going to move some of these bricks. There's just a ton of sand down here. I, I did shot put back. Shot put? <laughs> okay. So we're moving these coops from here all the way down there, kind of on the other side of the hill. Sammy. So we pulled it from Two this inches. end <laughs> and it there's termite damage back there and it just broke. <clears throat> so I'm thinking our best option now is to try and take it all apart but it's all put together with staples and wire. So the project that I thought was going to take a little while is going to take even longer but I guess if we take it Apart piece by piece, it will save my back in the long run. Uh, maybe I will start with the coop that has wheels, get it down there so I feel like I've done something for the day. outside because it's super super nice huh are yeah. you gonna drill something this. with that you're gonna do some building yeah okay That's... I'll let you do it okay. you you seem like you got a good handle on things yeah. hey are you gonna build something yes. hmm yes. yeah what are you gonna build what are you doing? I'm filming you we're going to build a new chicken coop. What's so, Ivy doing? Ivy's, Ivy's got the right idea, just the wrong end. You have to do the other end, baby. Mm -hmm. Look, here. See where the screw is? Mm -hmm. Got to match it up in the hole.
You know what it is, right? It's that mustache. Oh, the power of the mustache, <laughs> of course. If I had had a beard, there'd been no way. That would've just been too much. Okay, folks. I think today's vlog has come to an end. I did not accomplish everything I wanted to. Not quite, anyway. Um, but hopefully this week we can get the other bit of the... Of the uh, it used to be the dog kennel. We'll get that down there for the chickens and be able to put it all together because I want to get... I want to get some chickens so bad! Um, and I found a good deal on them. I just have to have a place for the chickens first. So we want to try and crank this out as quick as we can. Oh, well, I want to say... Um, if you, if you haven't checked out any of our links down in our description, go ahead and do that. We've got some other, um, some other social media accounts that we're active on. Laurel posts to Instagram all the time, so make sure and check that out. She's also written some new blogs lately. You're going to want to look at those. Um, I think that's all we have for you today. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you later. What happened to your superpowers? I'm just not very strong. <laughs> Hearing Teddy's gonna have to muscle it by himself. Sorry. I can push. <laughs>